Tongan proverb, Balobebi for the Tonga, for Ui Nefai, fault of the for Ui. It is said that the Tuitonga Delea, known also as Uwaki Mata, once went on a trip to the northern parts of Tonga. Delea was accompanied by his very beautiful wife, Dalafaiwa. When they reached Vavao, they were determined to stay on the island of Ewakaka. House and grounds therefore were prepared for them, and when all was completed, the king and his wife walked around the compound to inspect their new home. They were perfectly satisfied with the arrangements made, except that Dalafaiwa requested that a Fu'ui tree, which had been left standing just outside the palisade, be cut down. She thought that this might furnish means for Kalata's time entry into the compound. The king, however, thought her fears groundless, and the tree was left standing. So they stayed in Ewagafa, and the king travelled around Mava'u, attending to his kingly duties. During one of his absences, a handsome man of Mava'u, whom tradition is inclined to identify with Lepuha, climbed the Pui tree and entered the compound. So great was his attractiveness that the beautiful Dalafaiva yielded to his advances. Before he left, he tattooed or painted a design on her belly as a mark of his conquest. And so, when the king returned, her infidelity was apparent. Delea, in his anger, called to his attendant Alka to smite the woman. Alka happened at the time to be cutting firewood and he sprang forward with a billet of wood and struck her dead. Delea grieved, for he dearly loved his wife and thought that Alka would have known his heart sufficiently well not to have interpreted his bidding so harshly. But the fatal deed was done and it was beyond recall. The punishment was too severe that Dalafaiva died. She cried out with her last words to tell Uwaki Mata her love for him. But it is his own for Ui tree that was the cause of the incident. When these last words were passed on to Uwaki Mata, he was heart stricken, as it wasn't his intention to take the life of Dalafaiva. Another proverb, Tu Anaki Aukau, trust in Aukau, emerged in such a scene as a result literally meaning it cost as trust on Alka not to kill Dalafaiva, but just to punish her. Yet her life was by accident sadly taken away. However, if it was not for the Fu'ui tree, his home would not have been destroyed, and his beloved Dalafaiva would not have died. It was his own Fu'ui tree that was at fault and at cause often used in a context to refer to an incident that has happened to someone brought by his or her own action. For we may find fault of the fault.